first jump, I wanted to come off the right lead. Normally, I, if you were going to the right, I would have done a left-right slice. But I felt like you could not do six in that line. And if I angled in towards the second jump, I would have been really slow in the seven. So I thought the right lead would force me to bend the line. Um, so I did that and I really was like a hard angle, which I loved. So I got a really good turn back to the next jump, but then I had to like add last minute because the long one wasn't really showing up. Um, and then I just ran and got him like a good turn on that blue oxer, the nine. You know, I looked in for eight, but it just wasn't showing up. So I did the nine and then I really dared him to the double, which I think earlier in his career, that's where I needed to take more time, but he's gotten so seasoned and I got a good right roll back in the warm up and he got a little bump on the vertical. So I thought, okay, I can like risk this a little bit because I added in both lines. So I was like, I need to pick it up and he was brilliant. And then I just did what I felt like was the right move to the last and he's such a good boy. Like, I don't, I don't really know what else to say.